Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls. If you're truly really loaded into the mad, high load of flows is harbinger. Just be fun and glad to you. Boxes might be cute as fuck in 2013 and all around neutral guy. I guess you cannot be summoned into this location. Is that the right understanding? Of the situation? Well, this is pretty long a shaft um dry ring yeah yeah, yeah. i al already put the ring on it should be fine apparently without the ring you start taking damage from the abyss the abyss it's just this place wait are we actually gonna oh we need to take four damage Alright. King number one, I see you. Oh, well, seeing you is not all that useful, apparently. Oof. Freak up, freak up. Stab a lot. Uh, don't get dead. Don't dead. Okay, another king has been summoned. So there's that. Uh, drink, I guess? We have so many flasks. We might as well. Come on, then. The thing is, I have to keep stabbing him once he's dead. To ensure that actually there is enough damage dealt to the bastard. <laughs> but this is silly. We're not gonna make it, are we? No, we are not. Shame. We are so close as well. We actually got to the four kings. Maybe if I use the other weapon for that singular purpose, that might help. I think I do want to repair my sword there, so that's something to consider. Also, might as well switch back to item discovery then, because that's also useful. And then we'll see if we can summon one at a time. Let's summon more taunt. Hello? Okay, we've got one. We've got two. Alright. Should be fine. Get the souls, repair my equipment, and go back into the abyss. Assuming we can make our way down there again. I also took the opportunity to upgrade my skirt a little with the Titan and Chunk we found earlier. Hey, hi. Seriously? Seriously? Fine. Oh well. You sir are busted. Just so you know. Ah, I can't look onto you. There we go. That's more like it. Titanite Chunk. Oh yeah, that means more upgrades for my skirt. And then depending on my patience, I can either go with upgrading my gloves further, but that may be less useful than the alternative, which would be to upgrade, you know, to wait for enough to upgrade my skirt further. 
Because I might go, might go for heavier gloves once I know I will no longer use the great sword. Which will be soon. I think I'll use it for the four kings. My device. Might be. Come on, give me your slaps. I want something for my sword as well. They are known to drop slabs. There was one who reported on the wiki that he once got two slabs in a row and everyone considered him one of the luckiest men in Dark Souls. Unless they were a lady. Gender was not specified, so they may have been... Well, generally they were really lucky. Let's put it like that. No need to bring gender into this. Also, it's chunk. One more chunk and I can get my skirt to plus nine. Oh yeah. That should keep me alive for a bit longer, I think. I'm over here. I want the possibility of you being able to drop me a slab. Up. Nothing. Nothing. I feel so betrayed by the loot table. Alright, uh, then we go in. Don't whom we can and run away. Now we observe on whom we were able to taunt, which was this. Oh, two ghosts and a wraith. Okay. So we got the ghosts, or we got a ghost. Which is pretty good as well. No loot, no loot. Alright, uh, where did the other ghost go? No, it's still alive. There it is. Fine. <laughs> that also works. Uh, also, can I use this? I can! It's kinda silly. Whoop. I also keep make, mucking up my assault plan. Right then. This went well enough. You? Do you want to fight? I suppose no. That's it. Appear to be not. No fight for him then, I guess. Hello. May I interest you in this fine leather stabbing? Oh, whoop. Oh, Good thing my re in stamina region is as it is. Wait. That was even using the shield. Maybe if I use tried fire against the four kings. Maybe that would work as well. The first things first. Get in the spire. Uh, second things for a second, I guess. Not first anymore. Traverse abyss. Then get the great sword of Artorius. And prepare for a smackdown. I wonder if I would take full damage if I were to simply jump off the whole pillar instead of, you know, traversing it as if it was meant to be traversed like this. We and off we go. It's a good thing this long fall doesn't actually provide us with fall damage there. Hmm. Where is he? There. There. I want to try the fire. Didn't reach. Alright, homing missiles don't sound like fun. So let's see how well we can stab him. Uh, 
bit. Come on. Apparently we take less damage when we're closer to him then. So that's something to keep in mind. Oh. Second thing in play. Click up. Try to get closer now because there's a bloody young missile already in play. One more. Drink. Drink, drink, drink. drink. And stab. Stab a lot. Stab. Stab. Uh, roll. Stab. 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 Uh, drink. Where is the king? There it is. Yeah, I guess we weren't close enough yet. Oop. Pick up. And get stabbing. We might do this. We legitimately, legitimately may be able to do this. If we stay close enough. Because it's the tip of the blade that will do the damage. So we were able to defeat the four kings by killing three kings because they share a health pool and to take damage after they're dead. Excellent. Four kings defeated. Humanity got. Wait, was that for humanity? It was. Nice. 60,000 souls also got. Bonfire lit. Rest at it. Level up my dexterity, I think. Or do I want to? As I mentioned previously, I could use these to get more of those. Uh... Yeah, let's see how that works. Accept. Uh, leave. And then warp us to the chamber of the princess. Yeah, that should work. Ah, uh, yes. Now. Uh, also, repair my shite, because why not? It's not very broken, but you know, it's best to keep it at top shape, shall we say? Uh, yes, we shall. Get that there. Also, because we have solved this one issue, we can now get back to using a bow. Which we should also be able to max, well, not max, get to 10 now. With my plan, being as it is. Alright, uh, get shield and this then. Because there is that one guy we need to kill. It will bleed. My god, will it bleed? Wait, is this a thing? Is this a thing that is legitimately a thing? No, it isn't. That would have been hilarious there. Backstabbing a bloody giant. Basic, but we were trying to do anyway. Then, and uh, no chunk from him. Shame. Wait, we no longer need the ring. Um, what ring do we need? Running action, I guess. So we didn't get any slabs from the race before we were finished there, which is a shame. I suppose I could change my mind and say I'm not finished there, but you know, I really don't. Feel the need to go back just yet. Also, I assume you're on the move? You are. I assume that is a legit actual air compressor in the background, so um, I hope that is not too audible. <laughs> this is what happens when I record on Saturday. So, people are home. People think they need to do stuff in the garage, and the garage is right under my floor. And I'm gonna die. Because I got distracted by an air compressor. The most legitimate thing to get distracted by. 
Looks like that was enough. Uh, no chunk there. No chunk. Which means no upgrading the skirt just yet. Uh, I just realized we have now enough souls to get as many slabs, uh, I mean, large shards as I may require, and more. A level, in fact. Uh, but, 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 I think I'm gonna do this the old classic way, which is uh, get as many shards as we can because, you know, we do have enough uh, small shards to upgrade something to plus 5, so we may as well have enough large shards so to get something to level 10 later. Why not? So, who has these items? Large slide and shards. 21 of them. 21 big ones. Then we reinforce our weapons, uh, namely the Black Bow of Faris. Yep. And our Grass Crest Shield, but uh, that's less problematic in that regard. Can I...? I can, actually! I don't want the Crystal Yaiter. Thanks for offering. I think we're gonna do this. No, wait, no, 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 no. Why are we in Crystal Tree? Oh, because this is the wrong guy. Right. Well, that makes sense then. This individual simply does not know the path of standard upgrades. So, back to Andre I go, and after that, I guess we should go to Lost Isalef. Though, now that area, that area does require us to be able to be summoned or the ability for us to summon someone instead. Not sure which would be preferable. Basically, the problem there is that there is a... Well, the bed of chaos kinda needs three people if you want to do it in one spell swoop. Because you need to destroy something on one side and then something on the other side and then... Uh, my other character has tied this so many times, it's not even funny. So, to be fair, dying repeatedly is not funny. Why is it so bright here? Can I repair something? Of course I can! Why did I do that though? Warp to the Undead Parish. Yes. Nifty. Hello, Andre of Astora. I have brought you some good news, which is the opportunity well, to upgrade Jack. these items. Seem right. I seem to be doing all right, indeed. I killed four kings today by only killing three. So, um, wait, no, uh, modify this equipment, will you? What is this route then? Raw? Oh no, it's probably plus five, and then we go to. Yeah, yeah, okay, that makes sense, I guess. Alright. Go get yourself killed. Neither of us want to see you go hollow. I will never require your services again. Unless I decide to get another weapon. But I most likely will not, but I will still not stab him because I don't think I need his hammer. Okay, I have a plan. It is very much similar to what some may refer to as a plan. I think I just did that. Anyway, um, I could look into getting some gauntlets that are less heavier than uh, Havels and upgrading them since we do have a lot of resources for upgrades. Yeah, that could work. On the other hand, I think I'm gonna go to the asylum. See if I can get that uh, one demon dead. Uh, that annoying demon. That the uh, demon who is renowned for being most evil. I just realized I did not actually rest at the parish shrines. Vanish one fire, so I should do that now. And I also remember the plan actually relies on me getting off the elevator before we reach the bottom. So that's also something to keep in mind. Alright. Off we go. And then I think it was 
this way, right? Yeah. Looks like it. Like a boss. Hello, Raven. Don't mind me. I'm totally not going to go into your nest and pretend to be an egg. Because what sort of a madman would do that? I'm sure it would be the crazy type of madman. Completely bonked this. right then. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. It's probably what they're thinking too. Why do you hurt us? Why do you hurt us? I thought we were friends. But they actually know that we're not being friends. Actually.